I'm Su Fujimoto from Tokyo, and uh, now we are in the, the Serpentine Pavilion II Design. The inspiration started from the, these beautiful surroundings. I came here to start this project last November, and then I was so impressed by the beautiful green surroundings. At, then in November, no greens, but uh, I can imagine how, how beautiful it is. So I tried to create in this green environment something between nature and architecture. So try to create the transparent structures which melt into the, into the background greens sometimes. That was the starting point. And then I was thinking about, of course this place could be the, the nice cafe or performance event space. So try to provide the diversities of the areas, diversities of the space where people can choose to, to use, sit on or to, to climb up. So it is like a, like a landscape, the artificial landscape. The ideas of the grid came to us in the process and I found out it could be nice to have such a transparency and uh, the size of the grids is now quite small, the 40 centimeter and sometimes 80 centimeter. So it means huge amounts of the grids are creating the atmosphere. The grid itself is quite straight and uh, rigid and uh, quite artificial. But if you have a, such a huge amount of the grids, then it is getting more, becoming more like a organic, cloud-like or forest-like, tree-like. And I was fascinated by such a beautiful contrast of the really sharp artificial white grids and the organic uh, formless uh, experience together. Of course, the, uh, the whole structure are made by grids, but then we started to think about how to block the rain. We couldn't put the roof on the structure because it spoiled these beautiful structures. So we tried to find out the way to put the roofs in between these structures. Finally, we found out the ideas to use the polycarbonate transparent round-shaped discs with tiling to each other to block the rain. And sometimes if the wind is coming, it starts to swing and then it's more soft uh, uh, atmospheres and a beautiful contrast with, uh, with the grid.